Hello everybody, this is Carl from the Elan Technical Services team and today's video is how to manipulate the hard buttons on an HR2 remote. So uh, as you guys know when you guys add an IR device some of the hard buttons don't work for that IR device so let's just give an example so let's say we have an IR device for the Xbox 360 so here's all our commands got a bunch of different commands there now one thing that's important is just to make sure that these commands have a universal function so obviously your digits will have digit commands um, some of them might not have any so A is green angle I have is angle so anyways just make sure those are all assigned to a universal function first then let's go over to the media tab and you should already have your Xbox 360 interface added all you gotta do is just click on it and over here you got your remote control buttons so the first column is the incoming button that's the actual button that you're pressing on the HR2 so the hard button so that's all those so if we look we'll see that the up button is defaulted at the Xbox 360 up command um, but let's see if there's any buttons that we can use that aren't being used so for example page up we're not using that on the HR2 remote so maybe we want to change that and use it since it's not being used for anything so the way that you do that is you right click here on the second column for behavior and it changes it to override once you do that you can right click here in the third column and choose which IR device it is that we want to grab the command from. In this case it's the Xbox 360 and then once you do that you right click on the right command and it gives you every single command for the Xbox 360. So the page up, maybe we want to make that I don't know, let's say track up. So just choose track up, hit apply and now your HR2 hard button remote the hard button for page up will now send the track up command for the Xbox 360. So that's it. Pretty simple, pretty easy. Just do the exact same thing for any IR device, keypad interface you got that you want to affect the HR2 remote. Keep in mind as well that you can make any of those hard buttons a different IR device and a different output command. So that's it. Alright guys, visit us on the Diller forum. Make sure you check that out. Uh, go to the Elon Diller website. You'll see the forum link at the top and you'll be able to watch these videos from there. There's a video sub forum right in the G forum and you'll see all our list of videos. Alright, have a great day.